All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to The Real Music Observer. My name is Dave, and I'm observing real music in real time for real people, just like you right there and me right here. So briefly, I want to mention Escape Music, a record label that I am going to be helping out in the sense of promoting some of their artists and talking about some of their artists and uh, listening to their artists and just saying, wow, I wish this kind of music would be more popular here in America. Uh, Escape promotes some great bands. I told you first here about Pinnacle Point. I think it was the only video that anyone did about Pinnacle Point was right here and I did two videos because the first one was uh, sought after and uh, watched and the second one hopefully explained further the music of Pinnacle Point but Escape is a great label. It's also a very important album by the band Journey. And Journey is the subject of this video. And I want to talk briefly about what I think is going to happen because I sort of teased the idea that I knew something about what Journey may or may not do next year. Everybody thinks, well, maybe this is just the end for Journey. Um, I got one way to look at things it's this it's the almighty dollar and it's going to push these boys back onto the touring scene next year rumor has it that journey and Def Leppard will be touring together I'm not sure who's getting the top of the bill <laughs> this is typically a real sticking point for Neil Sean as I think he wants the band to get top billing. I'm not sure if they will, but my guess is they probably will. And uh, does everybody get back to do this? Yeah, I think so. I think here's here's my logic on this. Uh, haven't heard too much about this amazing blues project that uh, is supposed to, you know, go off uh, without a hitch with John Waite. Haven't heard about John Waite, Neil Sean, and whoever else are supposed to be in this powerhouse blues band. Haven't heard anything about it. Not sure if John Waite wants to sing the blues or if he can sing the blues. His voice to me doesn't seem as though it's um, blues worthy. Let's put it that way. I mean, I love John Waite, but maybe, you know, may, anything's possible. I mean, Pat Benatar did a blues album, so maybe John Waite and Neil Sean will do one. Uh, but you think by now, I mean, Arnell is on tour. Uh, Jonathan Kane definitely coming out with a Christmas album, even though the tour was postponed or canceled. Uh, Steve Smith is out there drumming. And Ross Valerie is probably at home hanging out and enjoying life. Uh, <laughs> and the rest of uh, various folks like Steve Jerry are out on the road pounding the pavement and uh, doing what they can do to earn a living. Good for him, by the way. So my theory is that really these guys don't have anything so incredible uh, to do next year that they would just break the band up yet. Uh, I think after next year, things get much more interesting and a little dicier. Okay, so that's my theory on this. Uh, do I have intel on this? Not necessarily. Uh, I do have folks that agree with me who've I've, who I've talked with about it, and so that's where I'm at with the whole journey thing. I think they will tour with uh, Def Leppard. I think it'll be a big tour, and again, you've got to be concerned about Arnell's voice because they're going to bang out three or four shows in a week, and it's going to be that whole routine again. Uh, <laughs> You know, will Steve Smith come back? That's an interesting topic. Uh, I'm not sure if Smitty is coming back. And I know Dean said no way. So who's going to be the drummer? Well, maybe Steve comes back. I don't know. Uh, again, if it's a big enough paycheck and a big enough draw, I think everybody who is here this year will be back next year. I know that's crazy after all the speculating I've done, uh, but it was speculation just like this is. And I know that Def Leppard is very interested in touring and touring with Journey. 
next year. So we'll see how that works out. Again, check out Escape Music if you have an opportunity. They have great stuff over there on that label. It's a very unique label where the music pretty much is all good stuff. And I will be talking about bands, uh, new music that's coming forth. Uh, I'm going to have some exclusives as well, according to the record label, which should be a lot of fun. So uh, we'll talk about that in short time, hopefully. In the meantime, you have yourself a great day, and I'll be back with more real music real soon in real time, just for folks like you and me. Talk to you then.